Uh, Matt Viator, I'm the head football coach at McNeese. Uh, I've been the head coach eight years. Actually, been here 15. Was the offensive coordinator, and now I'm the head coach. Uh, was in high school before that. Uh, head coach at three different places, and uh, pretty much it. Well, we appreciate you know uh, Deontay being recognized, and uh, you know, an all-purpose definitely fit what he did for us. I mean, if you go back and look through the years, and uh, had just a phenomenal year this year as both a returner and a wide receiver. Uh, Deontay's actually played some quarterback here in the past when we got in our Wildcat sets. Uh, he's played some running back in the past. And uh, just one of the guys that, uh, you know, you try to, you stay up late at night, we do as a staff, trying to figure out how to get him the football. Because when he gets his hands on the football, great things happen. And so uh, we're just proud of him here. And uh, like I said, we appreciate him being recognized or whatever, because he had a phenomenal season. You know, we hope to be, uh, what we aim to do each year is to be consistent. And uh, our expectations are high here, you know, in the community and here, and we understand that. But uh, our biggest goal is to be consistent each year. Uh, we've only had two losing seasons, I think, since 1989 here at McNeese. You know, we're, you know, we're, we want to be in the mix each year. And um, hopefully uh, we've been to Chattanooga a couple times, and hopefully we'll have an opportunity in the near future to have an opportunity to play in Frisco. You know now, so that's kind of our goal year in and year out. Uh, you know, to be consistent, to uh, be very, very competitive on the field, to graduate our players, and uh, you know, and to uh, continue to recruit fine young men like Deontay. Excited about our, our facilities here. You know, now that we have the new field house to go with our stadium, uh, we're excited about that. Our tradition here is great. I mean, Magnesis is as rich as anybody else in the South when you go back and look at it, in the um, the success we've had you know, at our level, and uh, we're certainly excited about that. And uh, it's big shoes to fill. And uh, when we recruit players, we tell them that. I mean, you're coming to a place and you're expected to win. You're expected to win on the field. You're expected to graduate. And uh, so we appreciate, you know, I do, the expectations. I tell the players all the time, nobody rises to low expectations. You know, so we set them high and, and, and try to get there. But we've been fortunate in this area that we have to recruit some of the finest players in the nation you know, to recruit. Uh, you know, our base is from New Orleans to Houston, you know, in the state of Louisiana when you look at it. And, you know, I question all the time, why don't we go outside the region? Because I, I tell people, well, everybody in the nation comes to our region, so why are we going to go to theirs? You know, so we feel like this area is as, is as talented an area when you look at it uh, as there is to recruit in the nation. We're fortunate to get good athletes. I was just, you know, he and I have always had, had this discussion and uh, told him to stay who he is. He's a fantastic young man. I mean, he is, he's a joy to be around. Uh, he's got a smile on his face every day. And, uh, you know, and that'll translate to any level, anywhere. And uh, secondly, you know, just be who he is and, uh, you know, continue to try to improve his skill set. And if he does that, he's going to have a, a great opportunity to move on and play because he's a hard worker, he's a great athlete. And I think once he gets into a camp somewhere, they're gonna. It's hard not to like him. You know, number one, his talent. Number two, his personality, his work ethic. It's contagious. He's a great kid, and uh, you know, they graduated here in business in three and a half years and did everything the way it's supposed to be done. And uh, and he'll make it whatever he decides to do. Matt Viator, I'm the head football coach at McNeese State. Uh, we're very excited about 2014. We're having a great spring, and uh, we're going to have a really good football team, we think, and we're looking forward to it. Looking forward to opening up in Lincoln, Nebraska on September 6th.